Well, all morning, Marty has been learning about the art of illusion. Yes, let's go back down to Federal Hill. He's with Baltimore magician Spencer Horseman, showing off an amazing card trick a few moments ago. Yeah, and for those folks who don't know Spencer, just the, the 15 second version of this nationally acclaimed America's Got Talent, residency in Vegas. But a Baltimore guy, and you just stay here, Illusions Magic Bar. This is your home. You haven't left. Correct. Respect on that. IllusionsMagicBar.com is the website. Mother's Day, you're doing two shows? Uh, Mother's Day, we're doing one show. Normally, our shows are just Fridays and Saturdays, but we're adding a special Sunday due to the holiday. Uh, is it sold out yet? Uh, halfway sold out. It's a 3 p.m. show. Okay, cool. We'll talk more about Illusions here in a second, but I, I, I threw you a curveball. I said, I want to see another, because I'm standing here, and I couldn't figure out the other one. Go ahead. Perfect. Hold up your uh, left hand here against the table. Start with the first black ace, the ace of clubs. That's going to go into your hand. Don't move. We're going to go with the second black ace, the ace of spades. Start with those to begin. Did you feel anything? Nope. They switch places. No, wait. Hold on. Did you feel that? Nope. Now they're back. Yeah, just kidding. Don't look too excited. Uh, those now have jumped to my hand. There's no way this is uh, happening. black aces. So now under your hands, we have there the is no way. and the diamond. I'm Okay, <laughs> let's go to the, okay, I have no idea how that deal just came down the pike. All right, so um, if you have watched the NFL draft, magician Chris, illusionist Chris Angel picked the top three draft picks about an hour before the draft began, sealed them in a box, put them in front of ESPN's Desmond Howard. He got all three correct. Predicting is part illusion, part skill. And part of the job. Yes, absolutely. And uh, since I'm an only child, I kind of lack that team spirit to be able to have that ability to predict anything sports related. Uh, but we're in a bar, so that is more of my focus, mixing okay. magic and alcohol both together. Okay. So we know that you're a fan of uh, whiskey and old fashions. Now, here at Illusions, we specialize in a whole lot of different types of cocktails, both classic and a little bit more adventurous. So okay. we have a massive selection. But I don't want you to pick something a favorite, because that seems a little bit too obvious. Now, we didn't pre-plan anything. So I have a list on my phone of about 100 or so, well, about 70 classic cocktails okay. of different types. Pick a number at random, anything from uh, uh, 1 to 70. Pick a number. Well, I don't want to pick something people would expect you to go like, you know, a Sazerac or an Old Fashioned right, Manhattan. But give me a number, not 13, because obviously that seems suspicious, too, with your history of WGD. 26, double 13. There you go, 26. Now, on my phone here, I have a list of, uh, on, my, on my notes, I have cocktails, right? Yep. And you said uh, 20... I said 26. 26. So now, had you said, like, 25, it would have been a hot toddy. Had you said 27, it would have been a corpse survivor. Mint, That's a classic. chip, but martini. 26 is mint, chip, martini. Out of all That's these exactly different what it says. selections, uh -huh. all different, all, all right. different, mint, chip, martini. It's one of our most popular ones, actually. Uh, it's a beautiful green, just like all the right. mint, chip, ice cream, but it also... Uh, there's no like way there's mint, chip, martini And there. mint... It's a perfect after dinner dessert cocktail. Green and There's minty no and chocolate. Seriously. Give that a smell, confirm that it's chocolate, that is mint, since I know it's a little bit early to have a drink here this morning. But that is mint chocolate chip. Perfect. That is okay. wait, that's <laughs> well, now, hold on a second. Did you, were, you, were you playing the odds I'd go double 13? What about I said 13? What was 13? Uh, had you gone the 13, that would have been something completely different. That would have been a well, Mary, Mary Pickford, Pickford classic cocktail in its own right. Unbelievable. Yeah. Doing magic today <laughs> just because it's Monday, and Mondays you just kind of need a little lift. And we thought we'd come down to one of the best in the country. That was good. That was outrageous. Thank you. IllusionsMagicBar.com. Yep, IllusionsMagicBar.com shows every Friday and Saturday year-round. So plan ahead. We book up quick. Hey, thanks for hosting. Yeah, no, thank you really for Really appreciate me. it. Okay, that's legit. And I would never drink that, not even on a dare. <laughs> well, that could be your trick. Make it disappear. There you go. <laughs> Sean says, make it disappear, Marty. That's your trick. We want you to make that disappear. That's no. the truth. Yeah, no, that's right. I believe in magic. He's got me a believer without a doubt. Don't take that, that comment awesome. the wrong way. <laughs> All right. Thank you so much. Still to come on WJZ at 9. We're